Hello everyone and welcome to yet another video. I have uh, one more monthly. I almost forgot that. I don't know why. There's one more video today before the case opening number 100 comes out, I think tomorrow. Anyways, recording this on Thursday, releasing this on Friday. We are talking about the amount and the prices of booster boxes for flesh and blood. So, um, you are going to see <clears throat> the same picture all over except for Dynasty. I know a guy who bought a lot of Dynasty to open those. Anyways, let's look at this. Welcome to Wrath Unlimited. So after the all-time high last month and the all-time low of supply, we have seen a reverse in both. So <clears throat> the scissors are closing again. 116 is the price. 115 is the availability or the boxes offered for sale on card market that's the price including shipping <clears throat> and yeah well i don't know why i that usually happens in times when people need money it's not like there have been any bad news about welcome to wrath or flesh and blood overall um <clears throat> I don't know how big the effect of, you know, people buying magic again was, but it's five euros less than last month and there is a lot more boxes for, up for sale. Then we have Arkane Rising Unlimited, price went down, availability went up, 166 for one box and there is 80 available. Same thing with Crucible of War, the price went down to 100, the availability is at 130. So, that does not seem to have to do with one certain set. It's just through the bench, people or I think some big sellers just put this onto the market because, I don't know, they need money. The price for Monarch Unlimited went down as well, 136, and there's still the same amount of boxes on the market. And now we have Unlimited. This is an exception. The price actually went up by one euro. Yeah. But the supplier also ate more on the market. So 66, that's not a lot. But uh, since there is that many, I've just talked about the Monarch situation, Monarch expected value in my last video. So we've seen that there is still plenty on the market, but the price could jump pretty fast. Right, Tales of Aria price went down to 78. This is the first edition. 157 boxes are on the market. Um, well, that really does include the shipping. I mean, we could check just one. Ah, I wanted to open this for an example. I did not include Dust Till Dawn to this list because whenever I redo, whenever I put another box into the list. I'm going to have to do the real, uh, I'm going to have to redo the whole list on Google Drive and then on Luca Studio and I'm going to have to redo the graphs and all that. I It's just the way it is. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Maybe I'm going to separate those. First block, second block, third block, like I did with Majestics and stuff. But anyways, this is Tales of Aria Unlimited. 64 is the price. 178 on the market so price down supply up strange huh Everfest 75 is the price so that's pretty much sideways now and there is 291 on the market well there seem to be some people who want those majestics in there then we have uprisings price is still the same 74 there's more boxes on the market 180 which is not much but you know, this amount of supply, that looks pretty good. The uh, sellers can earn a buck or two and players still get the boxes for a reasonable price. This in Germany includes taxes. So that's the price, including shipping, including everything. 75 is what you pay for Dynasty. 132 are on the market and I've gotten in some cases. Four future box openings after Dusk Till Dawn. Because, well, Dust Till Dawn comes out next week. I hope I'm, get, I'm getting it on Friday on release. And then I'm just gonna 
open all the cases I've got and I'm going to record all of them. I am going to release some opening videos in the order I opened them. Uh, more at the beginning, maybe, I don't know, two or three on release day or five on release weekend and then the next seven or what during the next weeks. And then we slowly can jump into our Saturday evening live streams again because I think in the summer there's always nothing to do. So I kind of pre-record Dust to Dawn and then open that. And then I'll be back with live videos in some weeks. And mostly we are going to open Dynasty because we just go for the value, the expected value. All right, Outsiders as the most recent set, 420 on the market, prices at 74, as low as never before. Or I'm just checking this one time a month, at least in this list, 74, 75, 74, 75. So that is pretty much stable. And then Tales of Aria Unlimited, you know, Dust Till Dawn will be, is more expensive from the factory to distribution and from distribution to local game stores. That means the price increase compared to those other boxes here is meant to be that high. 85 is the price right now. And um, I, I, I don't know what these uh, number cards will do to the demand, but we will see. I'm just gonna track all this. Thanks for watching. Have a very nice weekend. Uh, it's gonna be a hot weekend here in Germany. I'm gonna be outside a lot. I hope you have a nice time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. How can I stop this? Here.